Every restaurant has its own heartbeat, its own spirit. Restaurants are like living, breathing things, and it's like you, they go in the direction that like you feed it, right? For Brady Williams, this restaurant, Tomo, is a reflection of not just himself, his heritage, but also the ideas and perspectives of all those who contribute to it. I think that like kind of kickstarts your own sort of like creative energy. A James Beard Award winner, Brady spent some six years as the executive chef of Canlis. In 2021, he decided the time was right to set out on his own and found a home in the heart of White Center. I love this neighborhood. I think um, it reminds me a lot of the neighborhood I grew up in, uh, which is in Southern California. Um, it's a very diverse community. At Tomo, Brady and his team serve an ever-changing five-course menu, inspired by the seasons and whatever product is best in the moment. We try to like shadow that line between being like a neighborhood drop-in place uh, and also a place that you know feels like uh, you want to make a special night of it. Among those most intentional of decisions, Ooh. making collaboration part of the fabric of the restaurant. With that, that'll be really good. You kind of work your whole career to like finally do your own thing and then you realize it's not about you and when you work with really talented people, it's constantly this conversation and this discourse around what are we doing what is good, what is cool, what could we be doing better? And then it just kind of like builds upon itself. That spirit of collaboration manifests itself, not just internally, but also with events like BUDS. B the BUDS dinner series is really just an excuse to cook with friends. And we started planning this a year ago. There was probably a list of like 30 people that we started with, but Jay was one that was always at the top of the list. There's like 500 songs on that playlist I started making already. So I guess we'll just hit shuffle. Whatever you want, chef. No rules. On this day, Tomo was hosting Jay Blackington, a six-time James Beard Award nominee. Jay and his wife Jocelyn are the owners of Hogstone's Wood Oven on Orcas Island. We cook with food from, from our surrounding area and we just try and make it better in whatever we, way we can, and then we also do uh, pizza as well. Jay's an incredibly thoughtful and principled chef. He sticks to his guns, even if it's not the, uh, the easiest way to do something, which I really respect. This is an opportunity for us to like bring him to Seattle for one night, you know, and uh, just kind of like show like how talented of a chef um, he is. And we're excited. Grab all the cream and just bring it over. For Jay, this dinner is particularly meaningful. Hogstone shut down during the pandemic. Then a nightmarish remodel with countless delays and ballooning costs nearly forced him to close the restaurant for good. Though he's been running regular pizza pop-ups, this meal is, for Jay, a return to the kitchen. It's exciting, it's also just like scary. We haven't cooked like this in, in well over a year. And even, no, three years. Because we haven't, no one's been in our dining room in almost three years, you know. <laughs> This is one of the first courses where we're gonna have like some cured king salmon that'll go on here and people will eat it like off of the branch. There are a few things that are kind of like, when we put it down, we're kind of like, this is the best we have right now maybe. So yeah, if you kind of, we're just picking up where we left off in 2020. <laughs> yeah. Two chefs, two restaurants coming together for just one night. I hope people, people know that we're, we're still like, this is, we're still here. This is what, we're, this is what we wanna do. You know, we're still, we're still doing it. And yet, taking something from this meal that will last much longer. This creative energy is contagious and infectious and we walk away from these experiences with something that we've taken away that we are adding to our restaurant um, because we were uh, inspired by our time cooking together. We're Seattle Refined. I'm Brandon Bernstead.